So over the holiday, and, and I got it both pieces on a discount. So for the Steam Deck, now this mm. only applies to the older non OLED Steam Deck, but I got replacement front panel. You'll notice the glowing mm. RGBs. Yeah. That's pretty. The RGBs are actually from the back replacement. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, the zooms have been so, pretty great on, the, on that, actually. Been, so, but the, the, the interesting thing, it was quite the learning experience taking apart the Steam Deck. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> I will say replacing the back of the Steam Deck is like a... If it if it takes you 15 minutes, it probably took you seven minutes too long. It's literally like four screws. Take it off. Wait, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight screws. Pull it off, put the new one on, put the eight screws back in. The front, on the other hand, I would I would not recommend it if you haven't taken stuff apart before. Okay. They do have a step-by-step -step video on how to replace it, but it includes used like heating up the L the L C D screen. <laughs> I'm and out using like a credit card type device to pry it to break up the glue to get it off. No, no, no glue no strip replacement. Sponger or whatever that call it's called whenever you do uh stuff at iFixit for Apple devices. Spongers. Yeah they Spooger. give you the, oh, they give you the suction cup. They give you I, I will tell you this. It's a forty ish minute I think video. Mm -hmm. Um for the front panel replacement. Mm -hmm. um, it is 110% step by step. It is, you know, detaching ribbon cables. There's the suction cup there. Um, if you go back to that picture of the, all the stuff that comes with it. Yeah. This... Like they give you all the screwdrivers. They give you the tweezers. They give you everything you would possibly need. And the cool thing that they actually give you is they give you a tray for all of the parts to go in as you're taking it apart. Mm -hmm. um, and they give you all of the replacement screws. So you actually don't need to keep track of anything that you're taking out from a screw perspective. Um, you could throw it away I, and that's okay. You could throw it away. You can drop it on the floor and lose it. Um, whatever. And they walk you through, and everything's labeled. The kit is very, very good. It's the make sure if you're going to do this and you've never done this kind of stuff before, like how you lift the little thing to get ribbon cables out, or how you pry off certain pieces of, of tech. Um, if you've done anything like replace a video card in a computer or, you know, install a new hard drive, mm -hmm. you're going to be okay. Mm -hmm. um, but <clears throat> go slow and watch the video. I like it. Um, I would say the, and the hardest part for me or the most fearful part for me was prying off the, the LCD screen. That scares the crap out of me. That scares the absolute crap out of me. So this is uh, looks like it's two parts, right? You have a $30 front piece and you have a, uh, $35 uh, the back piece to this, right? With the LEDs that you were talking about. Um, yep. the and the front, the, the front comes in clear brown, clear crystal, or purple. And the Ooh. back in the RGB variant comes in purple, clear, and brown as well. Mm. So you, you got to so. mix and match and, uh, however you'd like to there. And the, uh, for the situation. The cool thing about the the back panel with the RGB lights is it has its own battery and its own USB C port in the back. 